hello friends today we will see how to create beautiful small kitchen kitchen for your kids so kids special kitchen i am working this so for that i will work a very small chocolate kitchen so for that let us start our work now just work chain stitch length is not fixed one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve and thirteen okay fourteen fifteen okay so fifteen chain stitch i have worked now next in each of this chain stitch i will work single crochet stitch so for that chain one more insert your hook in the same stitch and just work single crochet stitch one now in the next stitch again i will work single crochet stitch again in the next stitch work single crochet stitch similarly I just need to complete this in each of next stitch I will work single crochet stitch in each chain stitch work single crochet stitch Okay, this is the last stitch now after completing this next just turn your work like this and now again chain one in the next stitch work single crochet again in the next stitch work single crochet stitch Similarly, just complete this. In each next stitch, we need to work single crochet stitch. again after completing second row turn your work now again chain one and again start working single crochet stitch in the each of next stitch so in short har ek stitch mein se hame single crochet stitch work karna hai this is the third row i am working and this is the last one again turn your work chain 
in the next stitch work single crochet again in the next stitch work single crochet stitch again in the next work single crochet stitch and similarly just you have to prepare square or rectangular shape here I have completed this last row now one more thing don't cut this yarn because uh, okay don't cut this yarn we will cut this later on now it is time to change the color here I am just using this silk thread this one is a woolen thread and this one is a silk thread so now I will work slip stitch vertically in this way so I will work one two and three slip stitch lines so let us start with the center so here just I am fixing this okay now this is the top side one more time secure this completely okay now from the bottom side hold your yarn like this and now we will start working slip stitch now from the bottom side take this yarn in the next stitch again insert your hook again take this yarn and work slip stitch so similarly next again insert your hook in the next stitch from the back side take this yarn to the front side and work slip stitch in the next stitch for this back side work slip stitch again in the next stitch again work slip stitch from the back side take this yarn and take it to the front side and pass to this last stitch So similarly we will complete this and chain one and just cut this okay the same thing we need to work here and here also so let us see at the end how it looks so here finally I have finished this four slip stitch what this is the back side and this is the front side okay now keeping this back side as this we will work single crochet stitch to, do, to join this From the back side, I am working this. this. This is for the front side, and this is for the back side. Okay, now just I am working single crochet stitch to join this.
from both side take one one stitch and then work slip stitch on uh, single crochet stitch from both of side take a stitch and I am taking from both side take a stitch and work single crochet stitch Okay, so here I have finished the join of this. Now, slowly we will take this in the front side. Now we will add some cotton inside in the center part of this chocolate and at the end just tightly secure this like this just secure it on both side like this on the second side also and we will cut this over here and similarly we will secure it over here 